Hey guys, I'm Isil Khan and in this video, we'll make an Excel sheet for plaster work analysis, which can help us of course determine the quantity of cement and sand used in the plaster work. Like as you can see, I got a sample over here and let me put a few values like for example, the ratio of martyr used in the plaster and I'm gonna take this guy as 1,3. As you can see, the values are just updating over here, okay? And then I'm gonna add the plaster work in square meter. Let's say the plaster work is 200 square meter and then the thickness which is going to be 2 centimeter let's say okay and I'm gonna press the enter key from my keyboard. So as you can see we got the uh, cement quantity over here 1.27 cubic meter and then the cement quantity in form of bags which is 36 bags okay and then the quantity of sand in form of uh, cubic meter okay that's 3.81 cubic meter that's so simple okay just add the ratio of murder okay uh, let me try another one like one ratio 1.5 okay this is a rich murder and the plaster work in square meter and let's say i'm gonna take this guy is uh 1000 and the plaster thickness let's say this time the plaster thickness is only uh 2.5 okay centimeter and then i'm gonna press the enter key as you can see it's updating okay that's so simple so let's try to make this guy by yourself okay uh you can learn it now and uh let me just erase all these guys from the screen and cells okay so now i hope you can uh, make these guys okay this table by yourself uh if you are a, an excel user and i'm gonna put videos over here now like one two these are the ratios different ratios and one is going to be the same for all let's say i'm gonna try three 3.5 4 and 5 and the ratio let's say 1.5 all right and then i'm gonna uh, add the plaster work in square meter uh, this can be measured on the side or from the drawings no problem so let's say 500 550 100 200 uh, this is in the form of square meter and let's say 60 and this guy uh, uh, 600 the plaster thickness may be different depends upon the project okay so let me take this guy is 1 centimeter 1.5 centimeter and 2 centimeter 3 centimeter uh, 1.25 centimeter okay and then 0 0.5 centimeter all right now let's do this guy now, this this was just a simple and plug and check in okay the main thing we hear uh, we uh, we gonna learn here is uh, to build these columns okay the remaining five columns all right so the first thing we're gonna determine the sum of ratio and that's simple okay just uh, press the equal from your keyboard and then i'm gonna specify this cell and plus and this cell and let's press enter that's simple okay and i'm gonna drag this guy down to the uh, all guys just those are below so that's simple okay now the plaster uh, dry volume that's the main point dry volume must be the wet volume and times some factor okay which can convert the wet volume into dry like uh, 1.27 1.5 may be different okay it depends uh, I, I have seen uh, those videos uh, much different in the different uh, books okay but the video mostly used is 1.25 and 1.27 all right so uh, I'm gonna take this guy let's say I'm gonna start with equal and then the bracket okay and then the area remember the area times the thickness of plaster is going to be the weight volume so area times the thickness and wait a minute i'm gonna uh, place a star over here and then the another bracket so because the plaster is in the centimeter we're gonna convert this guy into meters okay so i'm gonna specify the plaster cell and then i'm gonna divide this by 100 because one centimeter is one over 100 meters or you can say one meter equals 100 centimeters okay and i'm gonna uh, close the bracket over here okay and now i'm gonna apply that picture times 1.27 this picture will convert the wet volume into dry 
and uh, let me close this bracket again okay so that's okay now I'm gonna press enter from my keyboard okay so this is the dry volume of plaster and I'm gonna drag this guy down to apply to the all blow all right so now the cement in the palm of cubic meter uh, if you remember uh, from the previous video I have already calculated this guy in uh, manually okay the video is down below in the uh, same playlist and the link is down below in the description okay so the formula uh, let me just uh, uh, tell you that's the uh, uh, ratio of cement divided by sum up ratio times the dry volume that's simple okay so like for example equals uh, the ratio of cement and uh, let me start a bracket over here the ratio of cement that's this guy one okay and divided by sum up ratio so the sum up ratio is over here this cell okay just c3 and i'm gonna close this bracket and times the dry volume which is over here this guy and press enter that's correct okay apply this guy to the all blow okay like this one that's great now the cement in palm of bags that's also simple just divide uh, the volume of cement by the volume of one bag okay bag all right like equal uh, wait a minute control z sorry this one this cell equal i'm gonna divide this guy by 0.035 because uh, the volume of one cement bag is 0.035 cubic meter if you are working in the fps system the volume of cement bag is 1.25 cft or cubic feet okay here we're gonna take this guy as 0.035 cubic meter all right so i'm gonna press enter over here that's great all right so i'm gonna drag this guy down over here now the send send is so simple okay just look at the ratio this ratio means okay uh, one represent the cement ratio of cement and the another one is the ratio of sand so as you can see the sand is two time of cement or uh, in this guy the sand is three times of cement so we got a simple formula over here just the multiplication like uh, equal the quantity of cement is known over here right and I'm gonna multiply this guy with the ratio of uh, sand okay that's okay wait a minute equal the quantity of cement this one times the ratio of sand this one and press enter that's great okay i'm gonna drag this guy down to the all so that's it okay we got ratios the sum up ratios plaster thickness of plaster dry volume cement in palm of cubic meter cement bags and send in palm of cubic meter that's so simple just uh, now you can change okay uh, the video a uh, plaster quantity for example i'm gonna take this guy five o oh, 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 okay and so on just any video and just press enter so as you can see the changes were here this guy okay we got the changes that's so simple okay and a speedy work so this is it this is how we can make an excel sheet for plaster work okay i have already uploaded another video for excel sheet and that was an excel sheet for cement sand and crushed stone for a pcc work okay if you have not watched that video yet the link is down below in the video description and hey if you like these types of videos please hit that subscribe button press the bell icon and never miss an update from engineer boy Thank you dears for watching, see you next time, Hello, salam.